This is Howie Nestel with the education tip for the day. All right. I appreciate it. So, as a kid, and for the last 35, 40 years, I've been riding motorcycles. Love riding motorcycles. Now I'm down to the slower Harleys, but I used to ride ninjas, and before that I rode dirt bikes. And I used to actually race dirt bikes amateurly, and I had a true word brand logo motto, credo, that I thought accurately represented me. No fear. Does anybody remember that brand? Yeah. yeah. And so I bought the t-shirts, I bought the caps, I bought the stickers, I put them on my motorcycle, I put them on my cars. I want you to think about what two words represent you, what two words represent your business, what motto or credo can you think of that inspires you to do more, reach higher, achieve more. This can be a personal credo and it can be a motto or credo for your business. It doesn't have to become your slogan, but it can be something that you use to get you to do those things that you don't want to do or feel like doing or feel like it's necessary to do. You want to be able to achieve more than others. And two words, some motto, some credo can help you achieve that. I know you guys like playing games. I like playing games. So I'm gonna throw out a few two word mottos or credos or slogans and you tell me, blurt it out. No need to raise your hand. Blurt it out and tell me who it belongs to. What company or organization created this credo or motto? Ready, here we go. Semper Fi. Nice. Eat fresh. Subway. 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 Think differently. Or think different. It's a gene. Apple. 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 That's right. My computer got me. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Aim high. Air Force. Air Force. Air Force. <laughs> Ford Tough. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Chevy. Right. All right. Keeping, keeping in the automotive theme, runs deep. Chevrolet, that's right. Yeah, Chevy runs deep. And and they, you know, you've heard these companies, but they they've changed them out. Uh, Live strong. Lance Armstrong. So that actually didn't start off as a brand or as a movement. It started off as his personal motto or slogan, and he wore it on some yellow band bracelet thing that he made. Other people saw it, they turned it into bracelets, it became a movement, then it became a brand, then it became a nonprofit for Lance Armstrong. Get it? The same initials live strong, but Lance Armstrong and became a movement. So it doesn't really matter if your personal slogan or company slogan or motto is two words or not, as long as you just do it. Nice. <laughs>